Let us take you on a journey. How long will it take, you say? Time is complicated. Take, for example, the past. Whenever it was or could be, made of events, experienced, known differently to one and another. Maybe it was, it already happened, but compromises the present. Our past became our present. Underneath the surface there is life unseen but vital. In Walter's memory, a daughter. She swam with dinosaurs, evolved for extinction. She no longer swims, she's left Britain's whispering weeds. Now I swim solo in darkness. I observe schools of others, fishes. There's more than pebbles in murky water, yet no one mentions this, or us. I am a sturgeon, Asipensa sturio to be precise. My mother, her mother's mother and before swam the mighty Severn River. We swam rivers of South and West Wales too. Today we are mystical creatures like white unicorns of folklore. Our family, Asipensa idee, is one of the most critically endangered on earth. Some claim we sturgeon are royalty, yet they don't put their names to weirs. Thousands of concrete walls, older than the Queen herself, remain century-old barriers to our existence. These are the shadows I live in, those created, maintained by others. Now come along, over this way, we still have more to say. Here we are, in the present, or has it already gone? Over that way, somewhere. Maybe it's now, the present is happening. No, wait, now, it's uncertain. Words spoken and actions taken. Wait, did you blink or stop to think? Now we take flight across the present. Suitcases are the latest form of transport. Up, down, across, even over rivers. There is no feeling of calm. I can't relax in a suitcase over water. Unsure of where I'm going. Squish against kind specifics. Brothers, sisters, cousins. I once flowed in with the tide, as if birthed from waves. Swish, we're off, but not up river. Our world flipped. We take flight. I sense we're over the Thames. Can we find a jump? Too late, the fastened seatbelt sign turns off. I'm a European eel, Anguilla Anguilla, but you can call me Anguilla. Along with my cousins, I move up rivers and darkness. Tired, we keep swimming while you rest. We've traveled thousands of miles from somewhere in the Atlantic Ocean. The exact location remains our little secret. After all, why will we tell you and your nets? Many juveniles like me no longer reach river sources. They're critically endangered, you see. We face unexpected destinies. Scoop, form, tank, and serve. Is this any way to treat supposed delicacies? Hold tight. Don't go away. We've still more to say. Negotiated our way through seas and rivers.
How could you know? Just a few minutes or so. Give us a chance. For our say, it could matter. Not only for us, but for you and for me. So maybe consider. Stay. Hear what we have to say. Make some adjustments. In the present, we move forward together. Legs travel underwater, making water twirl. Metal breaks count, a new land is formed. Old formations wash away. There's light we can see through cracks. Stairs, a highway to heaven, the river source. We remain, ready to shimmer, to surge round barriers, spread eggs over pebbles. From sea we bring death in our own time, restoring connections had. We, you, they. I am Tweet Shad, scientists call me a loss of lax. Don't confuse me with my brethren, Alice. We do it to mingle, but I, smaller, with spotty of silvery sides. I see a shiny future reflecting from my round scales. We can travel hundreds of miles. Swimming fish passes past where Weirs once stood on Sister Seven to greener pastures. Cleaner waters from hills that safely pass through gills of our children and their children's children. Small pebbles thrown, ripples extend sea, life. Silver treasures into flowing rivers. <laughs>